Good evening, everyone. Joe for Jaspi's CaseBreaks.com. Coming at you with some 2017-18 Panini Status Basketball 5 box. Quarter of a case. Random team break number 5. One spot gets two teams. So let's double you up. And all 30 basketball teams are in. Let's randomize each list. And let's randomize each list six times. One and a five. One. Two, three, four, five, and a one. Six times. After six times, Chris Hale all the way down to Paul Harris. Last spot mojo. All right, five and a one, six times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five. And a one, six times. 76ers down to the Grizz. Everyone see that Clippers win last night? That was crazy. Speaking of playoff teams like the 76ers, Chris Hale, Tyler, you have the clip show. There they are. Drew with the Heat, Corey Brown with the Pacers, David Bruin, Timberwolves, Thunder, and Kings. Chris Haley of the Suns, Charles Scrabble with the Cavs, Garrett Kerr with the Pistons, Michael Calder with the Knicks, Chad B with the Celtics, Garrett with the Bulls, Derek with the Hornets, Michael with the Spurs, Derek with the Nuggets, Lakers, my Lakers for Garrett Kerr, Drew Kerr with the Rockets, the Kerrs are in here, David Bruins, Magic, Paul Harris, one of your last spot mojos, Bucks, your other last spot mojo, Grizz, Drew with the Mavs and the Trailblazer, Tra that Damian Lillard shot by the Trail. Ooh. Chad with the Warriors, Tyler with the Raptors, Garrett with the Jazz, Chris with the Hawks and the Wizards, Charles with the Pelicans, and Corey Brown with the Brooklyn Nets. Let's alphabetize by team. And while you're considering trades, let's pop this case open and see which uh, five boxes we're going to do. All right, so there you go. There's the sealed case right there. Ah, Drew Kerr reminding us he's a Thunder fan. He did not like that Damon Lillard shot. Hey, as a neutral, I thought it was pretty amazing. Uh, who wants the Trailblazers? Right, I do not want to send Damon Lillard to your house. You would not want that. Watching the NFL draft, of course, ladies and gentlemen. I gotta organize these boxes back here. All right, there you go. I gotta get them all straightened up here. All right, so there are stacks of five right there. And uh, LJ Collier from TCU is the Seattle Seahawks pick. They're pick 29. They also have pick 30 as well. Where's my dice? Over there. All right, we're going to see. We'll use this die right here. All right, we'll go one, two, three, and then four right here. If I roll a five or a six, I'll just roll again. And it's three. One, two, and three. So we're going to do this stack right over there. These we will reserve for next time. Oh, and they traded that pick to the Giants? So the Giants get that pick. So where are the Giants going to get? DK Metcalf? After losing Odell Beckham Jr.? Oh, they go defensive back. DeAndre Baker. So we'll make these Wolverine slash marks on there to let people know. Where's my pen cap? Fell into the trash can. I got it. 
All right, so we've got the Wolverine slash marks there, so we know that they're from the same case. Wait, Crab, didn't, didn't we say Jameis Winston already? Wait, did we say Mariota, or was Mariota number one that year? We're doing a little trivia, folks. We're also doing, in the chat, if you're watching live, we had number one overall picks from 2000 to, to present. All right, looks like no trades basketball-wise, so let's print and rip. I thought someone said Jameis Winston already. We didn't say it. I said Brian. Okay. You are the leader of the of the quiz. You're the quiz master, trivia master. All right. Here is the official printout. Random team five. Good luck, everybody. Okay, so we got everybody for draft and for the draft trivia in the chat. We got everybody except for except for two thousand. Two thousand number one overall. No Google machine in the NFL. All right, good luck, everybody. Oh, Boston Celtics legend. John Havlicek has passed away in 79. And uh, the San Antonio Spurs force a game seven by beating the Denver Nuggets 120 to 103. I think they're going back to Denver for game seven. That's crazy. All right, what are we looking for in here? Looking for one autograph per box. Sometimes there's an extra relic in there too. So good luck, boys and girls. Steve Kerr, uh, definitely a relation to Garrett Kerr and Drew Kerr in this break. Steve Kerr, worried that flops will give Patrick Beverly whiplash. Uh, Clippers winning last night, forcing an additional game. Game six, I think. Crazy. Didn't think it would go that far. Um, Westbrook rejects critics after series loss. So it's, it doesn't, need, doesn't need the critics. Bucks is Malcolm Brogdon out first two games versus the Celtics. LeBron's jersey supplants Curry's as top seller. So a lot of L.A. fans still buying Curry, uh, LeBron jerseys. And an early jump. Rockets traveling Friday to the Bay Area. What if the Clippers win the series? I guess they could just go right down to L.A. It wouldn't be that far. Out of 75, there's Miles Turner. We got three out of ten. Tony Parker, status quo. Out of 199, Jimmy Butler, Timberwolves edition. I wonder if the Lakers will end up maxing uh, Jimmy Butler. I'm not sure if I'm not sure if they're gonna get anyone else. He needs to stay healthy. Wish we would have kept him, and wish we would have kept him. No auto yet. Where are you autograph? On a 299, TJ Warren. And there's the auto. It's, oh, it's Anthony Hardaway. Nice. 164 out of 199. That's the way to start it. Legendary signatures going to David Bruins and the Orlando Magic. Nice. There's Ivan Rab rookie credentials to 199 and rookie card of Josh Hart. Yeah, 
you draft 31? Uh, I don't know. It was, oh, Caleb McGarry, a tackle from Washington, went to the Falcons, and the Patriots are on the clock now. All right. Next box coming up. All right, next up. What do the Patriots take? What do the Patriots take, DK Metcalf? All right, offensive players going in the second round. Still hashtag good for the hobby. As long as they go to... To go to a kind of a larger market team, that'd be good. A decent team that we'll see a lot on TV. I'd like I'd like seeing that. That'd be ideal anyway. I don't know. All all that really matters though is that they perform. Good luck. Next box, James Harden. No, oh, trolled. Thought it was going to be an autograph. Julius Irving. Trolled. Yeah, I think... Lori Markinen, new breed autograph. Nice. For the da Bulls. Garrett Kerr with the Bulls. Yeah, Patriots did do something with Josh Gordon. Sign him to, like, practice squad or something like that. Nice Lori Markinen. Jeff T to 149. Zach Collins, two ninety nine. Yeah, there you go, Garrett. There's Jason Tatum to ninety nine. Yeah, the Clippers right there. Gallinari had a great game last night. And that Clippers win over Golden State Warriors. Definitely a surprise. There's Manu to one forty nine. Next box coming up. Wow. For that that NFL number one pick trivia, the Jeremy S. got it. He was a defensive end play for Penn State. Drafted in 2000, Courtney Brown. Wow. I didn't realize he went number one. Patriots pick is in. No, hey, Ryan, oh, I appreciate you setting up this trivia. You're welcome. Form of Mikey. I don't know which players are in which teams. Okay. I mean, team names are on the uh, on the card itself. That's that's a helpful indicator. And I'll call them out in the break too. Ed Ram, what's going on? Hey, that was pretty nice. Yeah, old Negro Leaguer, cool Papa Bell, cut auto from that NT break was really nice. You're welcome, man. Thanks, random.org, too. There you go, Jeremy. As he's like, that's why I take vacation. Every NFL draft finally paid off. All right, Patriots have got the 32 pick. 32nd pick.
Wow, so they take a wide receiver, Nikhil Harry, who's standing in front of the uh, Panini step and repeat right there. They must be doing the autograph signings. If you're watching NFL Network, you see Nikhil Harry, wide receiver for Arizona State, standing in front of the Panini booth, probably signing those cards. And you got new breed autograph, Tyler Dorsey. For the Atlanta Hawks, Chris Hale with the Hawks. And Chris also saying, Joe, did you know that Josh Gibson was also on, what, the cool Papa Bell team? The Homestead Grays? There you go. Chris on the board. There's Dame. Are they signing stickers? <laughs> Yeah, no, usually Panini social media tweets out something. I think they're doing the on cards for the early season products, like luminance and stuff like that, or whatever early 2019 product with the new draft classes coming out. All right, so. Round one is over. Round two tomorrow. Let's see what my Raiders will do early in the second round. Maybe the Raiders go DK Metcalf. Well, what do you think, folks? First round of the NFL draft in the books. I know, do you want me to not send that? you want me to take that out? Drew, Drew Kerr is a OKC fan. And Damian Lillard with an amazing three, which was a dagger to Drew's heart. We can, we can, we can take that out. Wait, I think Vet Base doesn't ship anyway, so. <laughs> Unless that was an insert. All right, next one. Marquise Chris, there it is. Elite Signatures goes to the Phoenix Suns. That's another one for Chris. Chris going back-to-back -back autos. Yeah, 200,000 fans out there too. That's crazy. I think uh, Eric Ange, EA, it's in the game, who's in the chat a lot, one of our regulars, went, went to the draft. So maybe we'll hear his report either tonight or tomorrow see how see how it went from ground level got boots jaspy boots on the ground folks he's wesley matthews to 75 kevin loved 299 yeah i guess that combine didn't help dk metcalf at all everyone was raving about him after the combine it's markel fultz to 299 that's still sixers markel fultz who may find new life in orlando There's uh, Derek White for the Spurs. Nice. He's having a great great season, great career so far. Kind of an unknown when he was drafted. Paul Harris saying, worst pick was the Lions at eight. A lifelong Lions fan. Such a waste of the eighth pick. There was another uh, Lions fan here who was also just horrified with that pick. What, what would you want to have seen? As a Lions fan, what what were you hoping for? TJ Hawkins, I don't know, you're giving weapons to Stafford, I guess. The tight end from Iowa. But I don't know, maybe that wasn't really an immediate need. <laughs> I mean, I guess it's a need, but maybe... A need they could have waited on, maybe? I don't know. Maybe with Patricia on that team, it's uh, he's going to try to use his tight end in, in a Gronkowski kind of role as he did. Well, not he, but as he saw many a time in New England.
Drew Kerr, not happy with the, the Seahawks' LJ Collier pick. There's some question marks here, folks, on this draft. Daniel Jones, quarterback from Duke. Sorry, hit the camera. Uh, quarterback for Duke going to the Giants, New York football Giants at number six. I'm, for those of you who watch college football more than I do, I don't watch too much college sports, but Cleveland Farrell, defensive end from Clemson, went to my Raiders. What a, For those of you who are into the college football or who can speak more knowledgeably about college football, what does everyone think about him? Not necessarily, I mean, was he worth being drafted at four? Raiders thought so. Nice die cut. And your last autograph of this break is TJ Leaf for the Pacers. It's going to go to Corey Brown. Now, Paul Harris just frustrated. He's just like, man, I guess every position for the Lions is a need, sure, but, but we just signed Jesse James. Tight end with the eighth pick? Come on. You got you to do something else with that pick, he's thinking. So that was a crazy reach. Yeah, pass on all kinds of defenses, Paul Harris. All right, so they reached, but I mean, where should he have? Where where should have Cleveland Farrell have gone? I mean, he's a Raider now. I got to. Oh, they could they could have gotten him to mid to late twenties. I guess you think they could have gotten him for that Josh Jacobs pick, that running back pick, and then maybe taking Josh Aker. Yeah, I mean they must have. Mayock must have really liked him for some reason, so it's his neck. <laughs> Although I don't think he's going anywhere for a couple of years at least. At least till, till, the, till they do a draft in, after the draft in Vegas. All right, other numbered cards? Nope, that's it. There's your break, folks. Thank you very much for watching. Joe for Jaspies, CaseBreaks.com, 1718 Status Basketball. By Panini, Ran Team 5 in the books. We'll see you next time. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com.